Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Tanks Gaming today again with another Hearts of Iron 4 video where we play as the Free American Empire. Uh, we are pushing everywhere pretty much. We are pushing a little in East in Western Europe and we are actually pushing in East Russia. This push isn't going that strong anymore, however. Uh, I lost quite a lot, few divisions over here. So I have to uh, enforce my troops a little bit more everywhere. I did put it back to very uh, carefully push. Just so they don't get overextended too much. Georgia has joined. Okay. People's Republic of Georgia joined the French French commune thingy. Uh, in Europe the push is going pretty much okay, I would say. They are all pushing on like balanced mode, which seems to be working out pretty good. I am waiting, however, for my troops to train up here. I'd, I'd rather not deploy them green. Um, I might have to deploy them green in New England and then ship them over to the Russian front. I'm not quite sure yet. Uh, we could actually check here for a second if we have any unassigned troops. We actually do, so we have pause here for a second. So the push in Western Europe seems to be going okay. I might add three divisions to this guy over here. Just so it's 20. Um, yeah, select it again. And control right, left click. So all 20 units are assigned to this division. So those, those three, three units should move over pretty quickly. However, here in Russia, I definitely need to add the rest of those guys here in Russia. Uh-huh. Well, how about shift click? Perfect. That works out much better. And right click them over uh, over here and then they should also move in here. Where does it say how many divisions are on this front? 38. Perfect. So they should come over here redistribute to this line and then uh, start to push again. However, it's pretty unfortunate I actually spawned them over here. That was a pretty bad decision. I probably should have... Ah, well, they were already spawned. So over here we are sinking quite a lot of ships. We did lose a couple of, plane, uh, of subs here. We did, however, destroy a ton of uh, destroyers. Which is always very nice. Uh, the push otherwise is going pretty good. We have nearly pushed where I want to in the south uh, to cut off Spain completely and then we are going to push through Portugal. Are we actually at war with Portugal? That's the other question. Uh, yes, we are. Okie dokie. Not too good. Um, here, I think ship-wise we are done, right? Yes, we are. Doctrine-wise as well. Plane-wise, doctrine-wise we are done. How about plane research-wise? We are also done over here. We have researched everything we want in here. Also in here. Um, Artillery-wise, we are going to research a little bit more of anti-air stuff. Otherwise, I think we are completely done actually with everything. Doctrine-wise, I'm done. I know that for sure. That's done as well. There is everything done and in here as well. So we are completely done on the research. I'll dismiss that actually. Hit pause here for a second again. Uh, we are losing everywhere here. I guess the front is a little bit spread too far. Uh, however, my military police unit, of course, it centers into Mexico again. Uh, we do get some more territory to cover down here, which is nice. I guess I should cover it over here as well for the moment and up here as well. So we are nearly at the German border, which is the German Republic at the moment, which is nice. Um, otherwise the army is still good, researched, uh, trained. Nobody has been completely trained yet. It's gonna take a little longer. Should I train a little bit more MP as well? I think I should. Not that many though, just like once. Yeah, maybe add one more, like this. Uh, Material-wise, we are still 
short on mechanized quite a bit actually, which is pretty unfortunate. Uh, otherwise, yeah, those are red attacks now. That was a green one though for a second. Uh, we are pushing into the Benelux area. We have nearly cut him off down here, which is nice. Um, I just realized I probably need to do a little bit of overlapping over here, just in case something stupid happens. Because otherwise that could hurt pretty badly. However, we have pushed nearly down to Montpellier, which, would, which will result in a very nice war victory, I guess. Uh, are all 38 divisions over here yet? Apparently not. Where the hell are you guys? I don't know. Are they still at sea? They might be. Uh, however, I just realized I forgot to change something in here. Which I should have done quite a while ago. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to leave that tank squad like this. The super heavy tanks I'm going to leave like this as well. But the modern tank division will be changed. Where is it? Modern tank type 1 here. It is. Uh, no, I'm not going to change that now because I have I don't have the material for it. But like when you when you watch my multiplayer together with of George has capitulated really already that was fast. Uh, when you watch my multiplayer together with Scriptor, you notice uh, I did something wrong there with my tank division, and Scriptor's tank division layout actually works out pretty much 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 better than mine. Uh, we are not at war with you, are we? No, we are not. At least not at the moment. No, we are not at war with Japan at the moment. So we're gonna leave that as it is for the moment. Are you pushing through to Montpellier? It would be really nice. There are a lot of divisions are retreating. Toulouse, we are kind of pushing in. I think we nearly have taken Toulouse, which would be nice. We are very close to the Swiss border. We actually are at the Swiss border, which is even nicer. <laughs> and the red army... Okay, I need to hit pause here again, so blue army. Uh, I need to extend your front line for a little bit. Like... Alt... Like... Till about here. And the red army... I'm actually gonna... Shorten your off front line a little bit like that. Because otherwise I have some troubles there. So we are nearly, it's just one more province we have to take. I think if you could like support over here, would be really nice. You're not retreating, right? Wouldn't I wouldn't be surprised if that tank is actually retreating in there. I'm moving around a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, that didn't work out the way I was think I was hoping. And actually, I just realized we can extend this front line to up up to here, because blue army has two divisions. Uh, purple army has two divisions more than blue army, so they could extend their front a little bit. Red army, I shrunk the front a little bit, just a smidge, in order to get them over here. So if we take burn, which would be nice. Uh, where the hell are you going? Oh, Red Army has actually reached their battle plan, right? Yep, they need a new battle plan, so Red Army... I can actually delete this one, pretty sure, right? Yep, that was it. And give them a new offensive line to do something like... Push to this river. That would actually be pretty nice. Uh, yeah, maybe to here. 23 divisions? Yep, that's good. So they should execute afterwards. Blue Army still has the order to push over there. Uh, Red Army will start pushing again. <laughs> Everything is red at the moment, of course. Some stuff turns green, mostly defenses, however, at the moment. Yeah, only defenses turn green. Blue Army's attack is still going green at some 
provinces, which is nice. Purple army isn't doing anything because I changed their line. Blue army, even though I changed the line, the attacks are still going. So purple army has new move orders, red army has move orders, everything has move orders. Uh, how about here? Everybody arrived. Hmm. Wonder where they sent those divisions. Can't really tell at the moment. I have three military factories though. How many is that? That is the question. And how fucked up are they? That's the other question. Uh, shift and click on it. Well, quite a lot it looks like. So, build another line of mechanized. Well, actually, if there is all green, we get another line of mechanized straight away. Yep, now we don't have free military factories anymore. We have free dockyards, however. So, we should hit pause here again. Uh, activate all three of those. How many of those? So, everything is deploying to Virginia or US Naval Group 2. We have 6,000 con 6, convoys, which is pretty nice. So I'm building midway class carriers. Carrier 4s. An infinity amount, that's okay. They just joined the group, naval group 2. Actually, I'm going to build another line of midway class carriers. And they are going to go into Virginia as well. So we get a new fleet over there. Here it is. Uh, which should be a little bit better. Um, if I put you on, uh, there are quite a, there are not a lot of troops on this front though. Still, I need to wait till my training is done with some of those guys at least. Need to add a little bit more. Yeah, I don't think they have started again. Oh, I have to uh, select uh, this. Yeah, go here, Nevada. Can't rush them out yet, though. As soon as I can rush them out, I will add them again to military police front thingy. 38 division. They're still spread pretty th thin over here, which is not that nice. Yeah, still nothing has been trained up yet. Okay, and it looks like we have our breakthrough here. Which means blue army... I'm going to delete your this front line over here and then like blue army H and then they should redistribute themselves to the other front right no they have not uh, so control and click on it so you go over there and yeah because the Swiss or no well actually the allies but uh, it's it started to belong to Swiss territory again yeah now there are more than nine divisions. That works out much nicer. We have a nice cutoff in the south here, and everything seems to be working out pretty nicely. Of course, we need to extend the frontier a little bit. Uh, we haven't taken Montpellier yet, uh, which is a little unfortunate. That would have been another uh, victory point and actually would have given us a little bit of territory and stuff. So if I click here on the war, uh, who needs to... Capitulate the British Raj, Republic of Turkey, Russian Federation, Republic of Italy, and the German Republic. So, if I get the German Republic to capitulate, that should be a lot of troops gone. We don't actually have to go for the Italians, but we have to take Turkey, we have to take Russia. What else was it? Um, British Raj. Oh, yeah, I have to take Italy. Never mind then. So, Blue Army definitely has to take Italy. I mean, if we take Switzerland, that's also very nice. It's not really necessary to take, but it's nice if we can take it. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, so here, everything is still marked to get done. Uh, Training-wise, the military divisions can be pushed out. Perfect. So stop it. And, like, I could have added them directly. I'm a little moron by doing it like this, but... Yeah, add them to here, so 200 divisions. Actually just realized I probably need more Mountaineers as well. Um, yeah, I leave it like that for the moment. I'm just gonna train it. And actually... Yeah, something like that. 
should be good. An infinite amount as well. That was the wrong button. And you're going to spawn in Washington. Maryland, actually. Just because we can. Uh, Building-wise, we are just repairing stuff. We are not really building anything at the moment. Uh, Resource-wise, we would be short on steel and on chromium and on rubber. So, for rubber, I still have enough oil, though. But for rubber, we could try to build some more... Uh, Synthetic refineries, which we cannot build over here any. We could build six over here. Which is nice. Zero over here, two over here, zero, zero, zero. Two, or probably just one. Uh, four over here, which is also very nice. Just to get us the rubber we need. Uh, in here we can build one. Free like that. Over here we can't build anything. How about Europe? We could build some over here, actually. How many? Two. And maybe... How many can we build here? Also two. Still 15 factories can do it. Up here we can build two. And then in France we can start to build stuff as well. But not right now. France is still not very safe. Will you please? Yeah, perfect. They're gonna get those guys done over here, and we have a two wide front over here afterwards, which will be very, very nice. Very, very helpful. Uh, Blue Army is kind of pushing. Slowly, but it is pushing. Uh, Blue Army actually has lost three divisions again, which is not very, very fortunate. Uh, yeah, I need to, I need to strengthen all these divisions up to their maximum, actually, to 24. All these armies to 24 before I can do anything else. So you can stop and you can stop for the moment. Just hold what you have. Because they're down to 15, which is very unfortunate. Uh, how far is the training along with any of the tank divisions? Modern tanks, mechanized, super heavy. Actually, I think the modern tanks just rushed out and I actually haven't selected it anymore um, mechanized I'm still short um, yep there we are one two three four five brings them up to 20 still going to add five to those one oh shit uh, one two three four five bring them up to here as well so, red army, like, control, click, so they should start to move, blue army, control, click, click, I said, so they sh should start to move as well, and, well, train it, an infinite amount, not really, but, well, Actually, don't do that. Just leave it like that. Uh, super heavy tank, rush them out. And then you're short on stuff. But still. Um, two, four. One, two, three, four. To this front, so they should start to move straight away. Perfect. Four again. One, two, three, four. Over here, so they should start to move straight away. Perfect. And three. One, two, three. Which will be added to this front. It's also on 24 strong now. Uh, so I have four armies, 24 men strong, uh, 24 divisions strong in Europe. And of course, I can't do anything for this army over here right now because I'm still producing. What I could do is I could train some more marines, I could train some more mountaineers. Well, I'm actually training the mountaineers yet, so that's pretty good. But I'm still producing quite a lot of, fac of uh, mechanized. I need to wait till the mechanized is actually up to date. And it's not that sucky anymore. So purple army is the only army which is advancing at the moment. Can you, like, just bop this Turkish division? That would be very nice. So the front is simplified. Ah, we have taken Barcelona, which is nice. 
Come on, just take it. Thank you, perfect. Uh, we are trying to push out of Barcelona, which is not working in our favor at the moment. I'm not going on aggressive, I'm just like, okay, uh, just stop for a moment. Will you? We'll wait till all the divisions are here, actually, as well. Because I just lost another division over here. Uh, like, stop. And then, like, yeah. Add him again. Well, <laughs> the modern tanks don't seem, uh, don't want to stop. It seems they don't want to stop. Um, there is MP shipping over. There is modern tanks arriving as well. And we are getting actually a little bit pushed back here in the north. We have been getting pushed back a little bit, which is okay for the moment. So, uh, five modern tank divisions are arri have arrived. Also, the blue modern tank divisions have arrived, which means the super heavy tanks aren't that far out, actually. Also, a little bit more military police is arriving. And actually, purple army should get some stuff as well. Yep, there are three super heavy tanks coming in for the purple army, which is always very nice to see. Anyways, I think I should... I don't have the material to do it, though. Really? No, I don't. I'm 4k short. 55 days, everything, everybody has everything they need, and then it, need, it still needs to build up. Actually, want, I really want to, to switch around the, uh, the, the stuff. Am I still producing super heavy tanks, though? Whoops. No. Uh, cancel. Like, if I click shift-click on that... Yeah, I'm producing super heavy tanks. I'm short of short of it as well, but at least I'm still producing. Yeah, this attack is actually holding. Uh, so how's the Red Army? Everybody is in position. Everybody seems to have some organization. Same goes for Blue Army. No, not everybody's in position. There's still modern tanks moving around, but now they actually are. And for what's for Purple Army? They are moving some troops around, but I think everybody has actually arrived otherwise. So green arm, uh, blue army will start to execute again, because they have a green arrow there. That should work out pretty nicely. Red army is yellow, which means... Estimated plan value minus 20%. The plan is considered to be risky. Large river caution crossing and the division is still preparing. So I let them do it to, to prepare for a little while longer. And purple army actually everybody has its organization back. The tanks have their health points back mostly. So you can execute as well, even though it is considered what? Disadvantage because or not some divisions weren't in position and the division was still preparing. But it looks pretty good. Looks pretty green everywhere, actually. So they should be going for a little while. So how is my... Ooh, the Russian front has lost some troops again. Oh, yes, they have. Look at that. That's not good. Um, how are we doing on rushing out? I could rush out those units and add them to this front. Well... Now they will just join over here. How about the mechanized? They're still training, so... I'll just do one and rush them out. And they just, just should just start to ship over here and fortify this front a little more, which would be nice. Uh, the Mountaineers I will add to this front as well, I guess. There's no point to add them anywhere else. So purple army is pushing, a red army is not pushing yet, because they're still preparing, right? No. So execute then. It's green pretty much everywhere, which is good. Of course the mountaineers are down to zero organization straight away, which is kind of confusing. Blue army... Blue army is doing good. Blue army doesn't have any offensive plans anymore though. So Blue Army needs new offensive plans. Blue Army will go through Switzerland down here to Genoa, right? It is Genoa. Y yep, it is Genoa. I'm going to let them to prepare for a little while as well before I start to bop them. Uh, actually, you two guys, you can kind of bop those. Afterwards, you can... Montpellier! We have taken Montpellier. Afterwards, you can distribute yourself again along the front. 
and in a little while, as soon as everybody is in position, actually inferior enemy, execute now. Purple army, how's purple army doing? Purple army has lost another division. No, nope, 24 was the one they had before. Uh, they're still pretty good, except the modern tanks here again. And uh, the modern tanks, that's still the design, design flaw I have made there. Uh, which I probably should really start to change as soon as possible. But if I do that, every uh, modern tank division will have a shortage on materials. Okay. Uh, Italians have given all this territory just over to Switzerland. Which is interesting. They never done that when I play Switzerland. But yeah, Red Army is pushing, but very carefully. Very, very carefully, actually. Army-wise. Okay, so uh, I have rushed those guys out. Or did they train up by themselves, I guess. I guess they have been done training. That's why they are actually sitting in New England. The Mountaineer. Uh, for now, I will add them to, Marila, uh, to the Russian front. Uh, as soon as they are trained, they're supposed to come over here. So, uh, Mountaineers, as soon as you're trained, you'll join this front. And make your way over here by the by yourself. Uh, the mechanized divisions, I'm giving all of them over to the Russian front. And they should start to move there straight away, right? They're all the way on the bottom. Execute, yeah, they're moving over here. As well as the modern, uh, as the heavy tanks, uh, the medium tanks, heavy tanks? What is it? Uh, armored division, edit. Heavy tanks. The heavy tanks are still moving over here, which is nice. And I'm actually going to cancel the next batch of mechanized infantry division. Okay. And I'm actually just going to produce this last one of the super heavy tanks. Uh, Mountaineers, I'm still good. They can train up as far as fast and as many as they want. And afterwards, as soon as they're trained, I will change the uh, outfit of the modern tank divisions. Or not the outfit, the setup of the modern tank divisions. But anyways, guys, anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you did like the video, please hit the like button. You can also subscribe to my channel or follow me on Facebook or Twitter. The links will be in the video description. And like always, guys, one more time, thank you very much for watching. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.